Pixar movie banned across the Islamic world due to lesbian kiss. On June 13th, the Media Regulatory Office of the United Arab Emirates, or UAE, announced that Disney Pixar's newest film, Lightyear, would be banned due, quote, due to the inclusion of homosexual, homosexual characters. Lightyear, the name of the movie, is reportedly banned in 14 countries, including Saudi Arabia, Kuwait, Lebanon, Egypt, Malaysia, and Indonesia. The same-sex kiss in light year was supposed to have been excluded from the final cut. Still, it was restored after the Pixar employees protested and sent an open letter criticizing Disney's response to Florida's anti-LGBTQ so-called Don't Say Gay bill. Earlier this year, two movies, Doctor Strange and the Metaverse of Madness and The Eternals, faced similar restrictions as these films were denied screening in multiple Gulf countries over LGBT content. In most Gulf countries, same-sex relationships are seen as a criminal offense that may be punishable by death. Okay, this is so good. First of all, hats off to all the employee employees um, of the of Pixar who protested this, right? Like, you can't do this. You can't like companies like Disney. They come pretending like, oh yeah, we're pro LGBT. You guys obviously you don't give a crap. You do it where it's easy, but where it matters, where it actually matters for you to take a stand, you take a back seat. Like you, you just like you just move in the direction of the wind. Like yeah very pro LGBT in places where it's celebrated, in the places where LGBT actually needs you. Right, you take a back seat. You 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 bend the knee. Right, where it matter you're anti LGBT because you give in to the will of, you know, homophobes. Hom uh, homophobes, yeah, of religious of, fascists of, gov of governments that are actively oppressing LGBT members. Right, and you're being called out by your own employees. And good job to them for protesting this. Right. Well, it's and an interesting. It's an interesting contention because Disney was actually reacting originally in relation to domestic outrage regarding because there, there's been like a lot of contention with Disney in the, the government of the state of Florida regarding legislation that they have going on over there. And this is important because Disney has special tax status for Disney World in Orlando. That's a big problem. That's that's a whole separate thing. So that's the background of what was happening domestically. And in reaction to what was happening locally in Florida, the company was feeling all sorts of sorts of pressure, not only internally from within the country, but also nationally. So they were like, okay, we got to like really, you know, be nice to the LGBT right now because we're facing some pressure. <laughs> and meanwhile, so that's happening inside and then outside internationally, they're, you know, just homophobes, Islamic homophobes are going to be Islamic homophobes they reacted to how they're going to react to this film and Disney refused to cut it partially because of what's already influencing them back home. So I thought that was an interesting kind of contention and back and forth. PK is saying for some reason, even Chinese China's CCP is against homosexuality. Yes. So this um, film is going to be facing restrictions in China as well. China re requested an edit of this film. They did not receive it um, because I don't know, there's a there's a branch of communism that hates homosexuality because they think that it's like anti like production it's conservative this is just conservatives being conservative right this is what it is right but here's a um here's another thing this is a win for capitalism okay and this is also a win for the superiority of american culture okay this is winning uh the soft power war okay and, and this is because these the movies that are banned there, people are going to watch this. People are like, do you really think Marvel fans in these countries are not going to watch what, Doctor Strange? Are mm -hmm. you, do you really think people that are into Disney are going to skip this movie because it was banned in the country? They're going to see this, right? And the fact that now they're going to see it with the parts that you wanted removed, it's going to influence them, right? So we are... You know the superior culture the superior values right are going to win over because they're better than your islam and they're better than your you know confucianist communist whatever oh legalist uh, ideology you have going on there in china right um 
and this is why you will destroy yourselves okay you will you can't stand against superior culture right and so this is why this is why capitalism capital when you let capitalism work its way do its thing and people choose with their wallet what they want and then the culture that is superior will become so financially rich and money wants uh, something that is financially rich will want to go and dominate more domains right and this is you would do now all of a sudden you, will, you are able to do that without any military expenditure this is why winning soft battle soft power battles are a lot more financially feasible because instead of spending money you're making money by doing this and you just let the best ideas win and again, this is why LGBT will win over whatever conservative nonsense that you have over going on over there. And also all the other enlightenment values that we're promoting. That's just like right. No, it's yeah. so true. It goes to the broader point of why like cultural wars are so much more effective than turf wars, on the ground wars, on the ground offensives. Because these stick, these leave impressions, these translate and communicate values that cannot be communicated you know, through they, they can be protected, you know, through advancing ground and gaining territory, but they cannot be actually imbued within a people that way, as we clearly see in Afghanistan over the past 20 years, right? Uh, oxymoron is saying why is china against homosexuality china the ccp is extremely against LG, lgbt stuff just like russia is right these are because again and just these like are communists have been historically all over yeah, the world yeah yeah i mean conservatives okay people when people hear conservatives they always think right lane or right wing all right no conservatives are also they're left-leaning conservatives as well right i mean this is like this is just they just pro, uh, the idea of i mean technically you could say they're right wing but this is idea of promoting traditional family structures like right? family values that's how they see it as right that's why they're anti-homosexuality they're against modernity that's what they're against I think, well, yeah, it, 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 it literally is a, an aspect of like, no, you should be reproducing babies to work for the state. That's if, it's you, not put just it that, its, if you put it, if you put it in its simplest terms, that's a lot of where it comes from. Like the Cubans would have work camps for gay men where across the front of it, it would say this work will make you a man. It's not it's, just. No, it's not. It's not just producing because number-wise, it, it's not that big of a deal when people like the gay population losing that. It's more about the idea that the family unit is the very essence where every other every other um, institution in in a in a society is founded upon. It's the cornerstone. It's the cornerstone of the, yeah. That's what they think, and it has to be. And for some reason, they believe that these the nuclear family. Is something that the way that it is structured is somehow hard coded within the fabric of the universe, even though the nuclear family is not more than 200 years old, <laughs> right? Like, like this is the foundation of everything, even though it's actually modernity, okay? The <laughs> nuclear family is actually modern. The people who are against modernity, they're defending something that is modern. For thousands That's of so years, true. we had the, for thousands of years, we had the extended family. The nuclear family is only 200 years old and you're defending it as if it has always been like this okay anyways i think like the third thing that we're moving towards is the chosen family right so we had the extended family for 10,000 years then we had the nuclear family for around 200 years now hopefully we're moving towards a new structure called the chosen family <laughs> so chosen family brought to you by the lgbt you're welcome happy pride month recognize okay so another neither we don't allow persian here in the live chat but another in persian is saying salam bar payam bar bi khudayan armin nawabi which means hello to the prophet uh, blessings or peace be upon the prophet of non-believers armin nawabi which is <laughs> i think that's the apostle prophet but okay uh, <laughs> Yeah, I wish I I wish we could watch the scene from the kiss, but we don't have. Oh that, my god, right? we would get like, a copyright strike so fast. Would, yeah, so fast. But I wish we could we could show it. Anyways, can we? Okay, so should we move to the next news? Yeah, but remember, I wanted you to show those screenshots. 
that I sent you. Yeah, let me actually have the screenshots ready as well. Give okay. me a second. No worries. Wait, there was a comment I wanted to highlight. Oh, yeah. In terms of like the culture war stuff we were talking about, Seth says, when government pushes society to focus on anything other than merit, other cultures that do put merit on top become more seductive. True in East Germany yesterday and Iran today. I thought that was an interesting perspective. Hey, guys. If you're a fan of blasphemy and sexy Cali, you know like me, then you need to be sure to subscribe to our newsletter. Link in the description below. Because if you subscribe, we will send you a free copy of our Blasphemous Art ebook. And let me tell you, it is the tastiest blasphemy that you can find anywhere available today. And we are so generous with our blasphemy that we continue to send you more blasphemy every week. So make sure to subscribe. Link in the description below.